Here's another perfect example. Today's January 6th, 2024. EP's in the wintertime. This is arguably the most busiest beach in all of San Antonio, Ibiza. That's uh, the Ibiza Rocks bar right there. Uh, look, all yours. That's the beauty of uh, Ibiza in the winter time. You just see maybe one gentleman there with his dog. It's a great peaceful escape. Some jellyfish. These are smaller huh, than the okay. Cullera. You guys remember the jellyfish in Cullera? Way bigger than this. Touch them, touch them, babe. See if you get zap. Zap, zap. <laughs> I thought they're supposed to shock you. Yeah, the tentacle part. Oh, let me touch the tentacle part. Oh, Yeah, got me. <laughs> Look at all these jellyfish. Oh, these are big. Not bigger than Cuyeta. No, but bigger than like what I remember seeing. Maybe they grow. And they're still brown. I don't ever remember seeing those. These haven't, you know, defecated yet. <laughs> they're see through. Huh? To run into here in the winter time. <laughs> and then right now we have uh, Cameroon versus Ghana over there. About to show you guys. Here in Ibiza, there's a, a big African uh, influence. As you would think, we're very close to Africa here. And not just um, dark skinned Africans, you know, well, Moroccans too. A lot of Moroccans, which some are dark skinned as well, too. But... Look at About to see them. I would say they're probably like the. The dark-skinned Africans are probably like the third biggest minority here. Yeah. First, I would say is like Argentinians mm -hmm. and then Moroccans, yeah. or or vice versa, and then it'd be the the um, Africans from like Cameroon and Ga Ghana, places like that, and Senegal. Like the lady that does my braids, she's from Senegal.
Good stop by the goalie. This would never happen in the summertime. Man, this is their, their, uh, their local, dude. Their local. Wintertime, and he, and he beats us all about the natives and the locals. There's even a hashtag. Ibiza Winter Residence. I think that's the one. Oh, Brazil. I don't know they know each other. <laughs> Down over there is world famous O Beach. I don't think I've ever seen so many dead jellyfish in my life. What is going on, y'all? What is going on? Look at that one. That one's still alive. That purple one. Yeah, grab it. No way. I've never seen these brown ones. I wonder what that one is. Brown ones which ones? Like these? all these tiny little brown ones. Yeah, they're obviously like, you know, like different breeds, I guess. Yeah. No, I don't know. When you see the bubbles like this, does it mean that they're still alive? I have no idea. I would think as long as they have water, they're probably alive, but that's... Look, and, and they're like... <clears throat> Look, all these are dead ones. The entire beach, guys, is aligned. The entire beach is aligned with these dead jellyfish. I don't know if they zap you when, when they're dead, but I mean, I've touched them and they haven't zapped me. This one's still breathing. Yeah. Look, you see it's still breathing. I can 
take you all along the line. The beach. I'm sure you guys get the picture. I can't remember the last time I seen so much death in one place. At the same time. In times global warming, I'll let you tell it. Something right. 